Hey YouTube, what's going on? So basically what I've got here is what I'd like to call the Penny Black Base Set. Now what this is, is the 1990 Copper Nickel, 1990 Silver, 2015 Copper Nickel, and 2015 Sterling Proof. Um. I'm actually really happy to get all these. Um, initially with the Sterling Proof, when I had talked to the dealer, they said they weren't sure about the coin coming with a COA, but it does. And for the Sterling Proof, of course there were 10,000 minted. Now, and with the copper nickel that doesn't come with a COA, it actually didn't come with anything. Um, the only thing that I had gotten with the copper nickel was the wrapper on the box from the dealer. And that's it. This is um, the Isle of Man Post, which is the official distributor for uh, Poe Joy on the island. Um, the Isle of Man Post is actually also goes by Island Stamps and Coins. Now, which I did not know until I started making the orders, but this came from the post and this came from Island Stamps and Coins. Um, and as you can see, here's the two silver, the 1990 in the NGC case and the 2015. And you got the effigy of the two queen, well, the one queen, the two different portraits. And then you have the copper nickel. The 1990, 2015. Now with the 2015 sterling proof and copper nickel coin um they both look almost identical um you can see on the copper nickel on my left that the finish is a little more even whereas it stands out a little more on the 2015 um also because of the materials you can see on the copper nickel on, underneath the queen there that with the minting process it got a little dinged up. Um, one thing I also noticed was the copper nickel in person it almost looks like it's got a copper or a bronze glaze to it almost with the color. So you can you can see the difference but you definitely need them side by side. Um, also the heads on the stamps and on the queen look a little bit bigger on the silver like just mildly bigger now what was weird were the boxes the silver comes in on my right there comes in that box where Poldry Mint printed on the inside but the outside, to me, the copper nickel box looks like it should have been the box for the silver, with the plane being the simple copper nickel one. So, so far we've got that. Uh, and of course, the 1990 one fifth crown. Still beautiful as ever. I, I love this. I love this design on gold. So now, all I have coming now is I have another one fifth gold crown, 1990, coming in. Um, what else do I have? I have a half crown, 1990. I'm still waiting to hear on whether or not the one fifth crown platinum will be minted. Um, I guess they still haven't gotten enough orders to announce it. And right now, I'm considering the 
fifth crown uh the 2015 but it is a little pricey so i'm considering holding off on that for a little bit so there's the isla man base set as like as i like to call it and now i also have another got another little gift from a friend of mine last night and you know not everybody's gonna like this i'm okay with that but for those of you that enjoy a nice little drink every now and then excuse me for a second i helped a friend out and he got this for me as a gift which thankfully my tastes have matured through the years and uh, Johnny Blue the one and only I love this stuff these other guys are okay for if you're gonna have a drink every now and then but this stuff oh man you can't get any better than Johnny Blue and for the price oh man for free this bottle usually goes for about 60 bucks by itself the whole set uh fortunately my friend works for my boss who also owns a liquor store so he got a good deal usually in this area the box itself is about a hundred bucks um of course our boss let him pay cost especially since it was for a gift but oh man i i i can't wait to get into this i'm not a big drinker but if I can get my hands on some Johnny Walker Blue, all day, all day, I love this stuff. I want another 7.5 bottle, but at a cost of about 250 bucks, I just can't do that. So, there you go, guys. Enjoy your day. Bye.